this HelloFresh box I just got. I'm not going to prep anything today. I just wanted to show how the box comes packaged in. Trust me, this video is not sponsored at all. I just... HelloFresh is not something I do every day because it's really expensive. But I try to do it like every other month, at least once every other month, just because I can get different options of what to cook since now I am pescatarian. So I'm running out of ideas and options. So I usually just get a HelloFresh real quick just to, you know, get more ideas and stuff like that. But let's open it and see what we got. like that as soon as you open it you get the two meals that you wanted so and the menu for those meals did I get that one this one and this one so under that it has this uh, coupon which, I don't even know, these coupons aren't even working for me. A bunch of coupons for next meals and then special deals that thing in there. And then it comes with this. This is just the eyes, I think. No, this is just the package that comes in. Okay, and then you get the meals. So this one, I'm gonna put it in the fridge. I got this one. Ooh, child, yeah, I gotta put this in the fridge. The produce, which I should have been opened up because it's been sitting there for a while, and then the produce is right here. Um, the bottom, it has this. It says, do not forget about ingredients which may be hiding under the ice. Which we have something. Shrimp. This is something else that was under the ice. Oh man, the ice melted everything. So I'm gonna put these in the fridge because I don't, I don't want them to go bad. This is the shrimp, which is not much. Everything. And then we have the the produce which I'm gonna show y'all when I actually make the food um, on Sunday but for now I'm gonna put it in the fridge so it don't go bad see y'all Okay. Yes, ma'am. Yeah, 
and like a little side gun, like a little pistol. That's because the pistols, I mean, oh, running to different. Um, and kind of like a cherry. Um, the pink one. Yeah. And then, actually I got my mom the 43X in that color. Mm -hmm. Did she like it? Oh yeah. Um, and I personally, I've got, I've got a Glock as well, I've got the 19X. You can yeah. take them, throw them on the ground, run them over the tank right. and they'll still shoot. Yeah. That one's $7.99. $7.99. Minus twenty percent, it'd be about one hundred seventy-five dollars down. Okay, and plus the ammo. Ammo is at nineteen ninety-nine a box for this year for fifty rounds. Could if you bought bulk if you wanted to, mm -hmm. but typically on single boxes. Okay. Thanks. Um, I just wanted to see if you guys could put like a live ball for me for my my headlight. This is so annoying. How do I get out of here? seven welcome back to my channel thank you for clicking on another video today's gonna be a vlog well the vlog is gonna be a whole week i was gonna do two separate vlogs one for the weekday and then one for the weekend because i do have plans this weekend to do stuff but i just figured i put all of it i'll combine all of it so it's gonna be a week vlog it's gonna be a long vlog i went to ross like you guys saw but the ross i went to i went it's kind of like an hour away 45 minutes to an hour away from me and i realized i left my wallet for one but in my phone i have my driver's license i usually put one other card in the back of my phone because if i have my phone i know I will have my license in my card and because i don't like to always travel with i don't like to always have a wallet i just like to get one card with me and my driver's license and leave the wallet that's what i usually do for work but i forgot so i went over there went to ross with that one card and i'm shopping shopping and i bought a whole bunch of stuff my basket was overloaded she scared all my stuff I went to go swipe and said decline. I'm like, what the hell? How's it declined? You know, I know my car. I know there's money in there. I even went in the app to check it and it says I have funds in there. So whatever. I told the lady, okay, um, try it again. We tried it like two other times. It didn't work. I got pissed off. 
Um, so I just said, can I leave my stuff to the side? And I'll go check what's the problem with the card. Um, so I went, in the, I went in the car, went to go call the company, call the people and see was my car not and was my car not working and nobody answered they answer but there's a long wait to get a customer service representative um to answer the phone even though i looked it told me i had how much money i had in there which is enough for me to buy my stuff and then some so i'm like whatever i left mind you that place is an hour away so i'm so mad because all that stuff I bought, I don't even think, so like, like, I don't know if it's gonna be there when I get back, if it's gonna be in the Ross that's by my house. I usually, I usually go to the one by where I stay, but they don't usually have a lot of stuff and I wanted more variety of things. So I went to that one hour away. I should've went with my instincts and went closer. Cause now all my good stuff, they're gonna say people somebody's gonna they're gonna put them up because I'm not going back there. It's an hour away, I'm not gonna use my gas for that. So I went to go to the gas station to pump gas and cars declined again. I'm like, what the heck? Why my car just keep declining and stuff? And then I went to I went third time is the charm. I went to a hardware store. It says decline. So at this point I know there's something wrong with the card. It's not me. Um, it's a credit card, so there's no pin. <clears throat> so I finally got back. I was pissed because my stuff wasn't working. So I went to, I was driving. I had an epiphany. There was fraudulent activity on my card. I just forgot about that because they had sent me a message last week telling me somebody was trying to use my card to book reservations for something and because of that there they stopped all transactions with my car just to keep my account safe so i forgot about that that was a week ago i forgot so yeah everything so that explains why it was declined they stopped transactions with that car so now i gotta um I gotta go on the website and request a new card and stuff like that. So that's why. I don't know. When one thing makes me mad, the whole day be making me mad. Yeah, that's where we at. It's getting dark. I did get one thing accomplished I'm really happy about. My lights were out with my vehicle, my headlights. So I got that fixed and it was free. So I'm happy about that. Cause the guy told me if it was something like a difficult thing to take out, like if you have to take the whole bumper out and stuff like that, he would charge me. But since this is like open the hood and it's right there, he didn't charge me for that. So he was helping me with that, figuring that out. So I'm happy I got that fixed. Cause I was gonna go, I was gonna do it on my own. But I'm like, if he's gonna do it for free, I might as well let him do it. And he was pretty nice though. So that's finished. I'm happy about that. Cause I already got stopped already. I didn't get in, not, not, I didn't get in trouble or anything like that, but I already got stopped. I'm out, your lights are out, you need to get it fixed. So kind of fixed. Check that off. I still got two other things I gotta do with my vehicle. When it comes to my car, I don't play those games. Like my car I need to get a car wash tomorrow too, by the way. I don't play those games because I've had with my old car, I've had issues with it. And then I trusted the mechanics way too much. I would go over there. They would say they did something when they didn't really do it. Or they would mess something else up for me to come back. I've had issues like that already. But this car, I promised myself I would never let nobody bamboozle me again. So he was, when he got done with the part, he took the light, blah, blah, and made sure he gave it to me. Because I need to see the part. Because last time... My car, they removed something. I think it was a tire or something like that. They said they put a new tire and they kept it, but they didn't really put a new tire. They put a used tire. And that's why I, I like to keep my stuff now. So the light bulb, he took it out. He gave me the old one and he put a new one in. I need to see where my stuff is going. You're not going to try to tell me this and it not, it not be that. You know what I'm saying? Like, if you guys get what I'm saying, like, I need my parts back. I don't care anything. And they're supposed to give you your parts back if you ask. So I'm taking all my parts back, all my used parts back, period. 
So he was fixing that. I was right under his face. Like both of us was under the hood at this point fixing the car because I'm not gonna let nobody I may not know much about cars, but I know enough to where if you were to I know where the headlights was, not for one, and I know what he was trying to do. So if he did something else, I would know. He wasn't trying to do that, but I was right there looking with him because you're not going to get me. No, I'm going to be getting guys. So every time they do something with my car, I'm right outside with them looking. I'm not sitting inside. Nope. I was supposed to cook, but I was so frustrated that I went and got a fish sandwich from Burger King. And I hate going to Burger King. I mean, their breakfast is good, like their French toast and stuff, but I hate going to Burger King because I just don't like Burger King anymore. It's just not good. And they be messing up your stuff and all that. I just went there real quick. I didn't feel like cooking. I was just tired. I'm done for today. I'm not doing nothing else. I do gotta go to the gym, but if I go, because I'm not in the mood. Hey y'all, so I'm not going to show my face because I just got up and I look a mess. I want to show y'all how I make um, this Hello Fresh meal. This one, you can see it. We're about to make this right now for meal prep. So right now in the sink I have my Bermuda. I don't know how. I don't know how to say this word. I think it's Bermuda. I think it's Bermuda. I don't know. Fish is in the sink. I have the broccoli. Here in this pan, I'm about to put it in the oven. So I'm about to cut my produce. the broccoli what I'm gonna do is it says to put just the oil salt and pepper and um, put it in the oven for 15 to 20 minutes which we're gonna do now and we're also gonna do the mashed potatoes lunch slash slash dinner because I didn't wake up in time to eat lunch and I'm about to go to the gym in a couple of hours so just some eggs waffles I wanted like breakfast and I also got shrimp on the side and a whole apple just something it's gonna be it's pretty big because I missed lunch completely so yeah this is what I'm about to eat and I'll see y'all after this plate is complete. I just did my face real quick because I'm about to film a video, a makeup video. So that's why my face is like that. But let me tell y'all this. <laughs> 
I just came from the gym. I was at the gym and then I, like, last coming out, it just started, I didn't even notice. Like, I looked outside the window. You know what I'm Like, fuck. And I'm like, what the hell? Like, I didn't even expect that. When I was leaving to go to the gym, it was just really, really, really windy. Like, I thought I was gonna get blown over. But, I don't know, it's weird. I had to run to the car and everything. And this town is very small and it gets flooded really easy. So it was already like flooded and I was splashing all over the place. So I'm about to film a video. I didn't film anything at the gym. I did, but I don't know if I'm gonna put that in this vlog. I don't know yet. I got home. I went for a run at my gym because the other one that I go to closes early. So I went to my gym and finished my run for 30 minutes. And then I'll, I came back, I started eating my post workout and then I was just like craving freaking Cheeto puff ball Cheeto puff Cheeto puff I don't remember what they're called Cheeto, I know it's Cheetos puff puffs, I don't know I was craving those for some reason so bad I'm trying not to eat chips you know and cookies but that for some reason I was really really craving that and I did not want to go out because I know it's raining. I didn't want to go out, but for some reason I just, I just, I just needed it. Like for some reason I needed it so bad. So I jumped in the car, went to the gas station by my house because it's 24, 24 hours, but it was closed. I was getting agitated already because I thought like, okay, all the 24 hour places are going to be closed. So I drove around, went to another one and they had it in there so i was thankful because if they didn't have it i would have cried probably i don't know for some reason i've been craving that stuff but yeah they had it got it um i was in there like getting that stuff and i got a couple of stuff for some reason i don't like small talk at all like whatsoever like i don't see the purpose of it is makes people uncomfortable i don't like small talk so I was in the gas station. The guy's asking me, like, he's trying to do small talk with me. Like, asking me, um, do you think, like, the rain is going to let up and all this other stuff. I'm like, maybe. I don't know. Like, <laughs> please don't do small talk with me. Like, if you don't have something to say, don't say nothing at all. That's how I kind of look at it. But I'm not a small talk person, especially if I don't know you and you want to do small talk, I'm not going to do it because it just makes me uncomfortable. There's no point to it. I don't do it. So, yeah. I just thought that was awkward. I actually could do a little... Um, it's not... Is it like good here? Little um, gas station haul, I guess. So, this is the one. Oh, it is Puffs. It is. So, this is what I was been craving today. For some reason after i even ate like i ate a lot a whole bowl of oatmeal and something else but yeah just one of those cheeto puffs and then i bought a peach red bull for work and a watermelon red bull and i still got what else i got i love these Bubblicious watermelon. Just a little haul for you guys. But let me see y'all probably tomorrow. Maybe not because I work tomorrow. So you probably won't see me. But we'll see what happens. I just got to film this makeup video. And then we'll go from there. So see y'all later. Ask me why I'm sitting like this, why I'm laying like this. <clears throat> I don't know. I felt like the lighting is good because I'm right by the window, so it was good. Because if I go like this, it's dark as hell. So I just wanted to just tell y'all something real quick and then get ready to go. Um, which is nothing really. I'm just about to go to Ross. <clears throat> And you'll get my stuff. Hopefully they're there. I'm pretty sure they already put them up. But hopefully I should at least.
find some of the stuff. If I could even remember the stuff I got that was in the basket. Because I didn't take a picture of it or anything like that. So I don't even remember the stuff I wanted. But most of it I know is like fall decor stuff. So we're going to Ross, okay? I'll see you guys there. I'm already late. The event started at, well, this is, it's not an event. It's like we're just going to hang out, whatever, at a bowling thing, whatever, it's, whatever it is. Um, I'm already late. I was supposed to be there at 730. Right now, it's like 810, 805, something like that. Either way, I already knew I was going to be late because I'm all late. I got back from Ross really late. I didn't even get to do anything with my eyes or anything like that. So, I'm going to see y'all there because I got to go. I mean, it's only like 10, 15 minutes away, but I got to go. I'll see you there. Hopefully, I can film in there. I'll see you guys. I'm trying to hurry because I'm already late. I'm so late. I don't even know. Whatever. But <clears throat> I got my hair done. But I had to hurry up because I was supposed to be there at 3.30 right now. 7. <laughs> so I'll be see y'all later. I got to go. Uh, yeah, I'll be see y'all. Hey, y'all. Trying to find a good balance. Hey, guys. Yeah, that's not weird. Ooh, oh. Hey guys, so as you can see, my hair is done. I mean, you, st you saw it earlier, but whatever. Anyway, <laughs> but my face is done up because I just filmed a video. This vlog will be out before I want to say so. This vlog should be out before just video goes up i hope so mm. i hope so because i suck with editing like i suck with editing like i i don't know i, I can film 10 videos but my editing skills suck yeah my editing skills suck so bad. i need to lay my edges down but yeah i had got my hair done i wanted to i've never done this hairstyle before because i feel like it makes my hair look weird but I want to try something new before next year because I have a different style I want to do. We'll see later next year. But yeah, I want to try this hairstyle and see if I like it just for a couple of days or like a week or two, something like that. But yeah, I'm, I want to show y'all what I got. I just got this sweater too, by the way. I don't want to show my pants because my pants do not go with it. But um. I want to show y'all what I got for fall decor stuff. I did go back to Ross and grab those things. Let me just. I usually don't go out. I usually don't go out anyway. So, you know, I said I'll go out this week, weekend, and I did. And it was cool. But let me show y'all what I got. <laughs> Um, yeah, I need to let's see. So for dinner, which is not really dinner anymore, but something to eat, because I didn't eat all day. Why well, didn't eat too much today? I got, oh, I got this, my fave. This is from Chili. This one is the bread. This is shrimp. What the hell is this? Pasta shrimp. Shrimp pasta. Yeah, shrimp pasta. What the heck? <laughs> so that's the shrimp pasta. And then we got some street corn. I had some fries too, but I already ate it. But that's what we got. I did my toes on my own. I just did the orange. My nails. My fingernails are like a burnt orange. Just because I can't have bright stuff on my fingernail. But my toes are always bright. 
and I did the orange by myself. It's gel nails too. Okay, so this is the stuff I got. So we're gonna see how it's gonna look once I put everything. This is the fall stuff I got. We're gonna see how everything looks once it's put together. And I'll show you guys. Four stuff over here are not part of it, obviously. I just wanted them. We have back here I have a Voss water. I just wanted to get one of these so I can put like fruits and um, cucumbers and stuff for my water. Anyway, sorry, I had to go put lotion on because my hands are always ashy. But yeah, the Voss water, I got this for when I travel, a leopard one. And then this right here is the African print dress it also has the it has this the scarf i like those dresses just so i can have around the house and just chill i also got this i wouldn't be me if i didn't get me a glass storage container this one is from master chef the tv series and if you guys know my vlogs you know i love master chef i love that show so it just comes with three pack rectangle glass food storages and here are the sizes right there you can see them in there i'm about to open it to see if i really wanted it i literally just got it because it's master chef and i love master chef but yeah those things over here didn't count and then here is the fall stuff right here i don't do too much halloween um just because i don't really you know, I'm not a big Halloween person, but I just got a bunch of candles. Yeah, I just got four because they're huge. I wanted to get some from freaking Bath and Body Works, but they would take too long to get here. And I want to start decorating already. It's already almost October, so we want to start decorating. So I got these candles, four of them. This one is Pumpkin Amber. And it was $7.99, I wanna say. Yeah, pumpkin amber. And then we got this one, Sterling Farm. This one was $8.99, pumpkin and spice. Let me smell that real quick. Okay, they all kind of smell like the same to me, but hey. And then this one is cute too. This one is spice pumpkin. Yeah, they all smell the same. I don't even know if I like this one, to be honest. That one was $8.99. I can't even smell it, really. We're going to burn that one and see. And then this big one is chai berry tea. Ooh. Yes. That's good. I got two of these. These are, you know, for your oven stuff i got two of these so cute thankful blessed and pumpkin obsessed i just thought those were so cute so i got those two you guys already saw this sweater i had on in the video and then i got this top right here i need to try it on and see if it's gonna fit me either way um just cute little top right here and then I got me a mug. I love my. This is Harvest Blessings. $4.99 for that. And then this thing. This was $6.99. Just to decorate. You know. I don't know if I'm supposed to leave it in the bag. Or if I'm supposed to put it in something. But yeah. I got this thing. I don't know what's called. Like a tray type deal. Just so I can put like, I guess I could put like a candle right here. And then maybe this. Like that. Y'all yeah, I'm not a decorator, but I thought that's cute maybe like that. And then I got this thing, which is the stuff falling out. Well, how the heck? I'm going to return this because if stuff falling out, like how the yeah just one of those to put up and then back here we have placemats it says gather together so cute back there is 
a rug, a, you know, like a foot, um, what you call those things, a foot mat that, that goes by the door. And all things give things. So I thought that was cute. And I also got these two pillows. This one and this one. I'm about to sanitize them and put them up. So right now I'm about to clean and then so I can decorate everything and see how I like it or if I don't like it. I'll see y'all later.